UFC Heavyweight Division Collision. Ready. Ready to fight. All right, so here we go with the start of this fight. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand over. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Well, really using his reach advantage there with that punch, DC. Big shot lands. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over. Circling towards the left now. Take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Big punch lands through the middle. Just missing on the high kick there. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Ball oh, slips and rips. Well, missed on that one. Not there. Oh, and there's another leg kick for good measure. So doing a really good job with that weapon here tonight. And if you're trying to slow your opponent down, mission accomplished so far. When you can land that many leg kick, you start to affect the movement. You start to affect the hand. Everything changes when you're blasting someone over and over and over with leg kicks. And you start to see the damage, not only in the leg, but in the facial expression right. of his opponent. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. Oh, he hurt badly, jab. Oh, and he counters with a straight left. That landed flush. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Slips the punch. Oh, he somehow ate that overhand. Wow. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. He is all about that left kick to the body. Lee gets caught with that one. Slips the punch nicely there. Real quick leg kick. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Oh, man, another leg kick lands right on the button, causing a lot of damage to the legs of his opponent, who hasn't mustered anything up in terms of an appropriate defense. He's got to check. Maybe he can catch one of those kicks to turn it into a takedown. He just needs to do something. For me, I would try to get close. Just not allow him to gauge range to throw leg kick. If you're chest to chest, there is no kicks. Get close to your opponent. Take that kick away from him. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range.
gets caught with that punch, he'd be wise to get those hands up. It's such a fast leg kick. Ten seconds to go. Oh, he lands a straight punch there, DC. We'll see if he can follow it up now. He has been throwing his strike over and over again. Look how crisp and straight he is. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC. And I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Checks the leg kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may float a right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Well, it's one thing to have length, that's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Let him go. Trying to let those hands go. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, nice straight punch there. Must be nice to have a reach advantage like this, DC. Lee gets caught with that punch with the right hand. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, he lands another strike to his opponent's liver. There continue to be openings there. He targeted it effectively earlier in the fight, and the defense hasn't prevented him from doing so. If it's not broken, no need to fix it. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Come on, push through it. Good punch. Straight right is there. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Nice knee to the midsection there. Big left hook there. Just unable to quite find that range. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Nice punch lands over the top. Superman punch lands! Oh, nice! Oh, big left! Nice job landing the double jab there, DC. I mean, you are definitely pressing that one. You love that one, <laughs> don't you? You love that jab. He loaded up there on that high kick. What a punch. Punch is blocked. Oh, it looked like that left hand found the target. Found the target as it has on so many occasions tonight. Right hand punch with the clinch. Connects with a right. 
Nice job by him to get the knee to the target there, using his length exceptionally well tonight. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. <laughs> 30 seconds remain in the round. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. He blocks the punch. Going back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. Oh, that right hand is on point. All right, now we check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. How about the display of striking? Just high level. I mean, you would think that we're watching a K-1 level kickboxing match opposed to being in the UFC. Both displayed great technical skills, unbelievable striking. All right, the action continues here and now as our next round gets underway. The previous round won't be confused for a round of the year, but pretty good action. It was a pretty good round. Not every round is going to have you standing up out of your seat. You understand that you are watching the highest level of fighting in the entire world in the UFC. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Gotta shore up the defense here, though. Oh! Massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Oh, nice right hand. Both guys landing big shots. Just missed on that spinning attack. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Just out of range with that strike. Oh, looked like he might have been in range, but misses with the kick. Punch by Lee. Man, doesn't take a lot of these kicks to produce redness. Look at the left side of his body there. Nasty. And they separate. Can't take many of those. You better check. Way to hide that leg kick. Flipped with a left hand counter. Just over three minutes to go. Gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting them up now. Nice leg kick land. Uppercut, but that one is blocked. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Nice punch there. What a tricky head kick. Left punch is clean, followed by a right. Unable to land with that punch. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bear's watching. That's gonna hurt this opponent. Oh, great head movement there. Slips his head off the center line, and defensively, that's exactly what you're looking for. It's almost like he can telegraph when the punch is coming, and when he sees it, he just makes a slight little movement, right or left, to get out of the way and avoid those shots. 
big head kick. Oh, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kicks back to back, just truly mixing up the target. Sight to behold. Liver kick. Lee's strike attempt there is blocked. Trying to establish that jab once again. Nice strike. Big head kick lands. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No free piece, uh, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Big head kick lands. Look at the turtle in that kick. Ten seconds to go. Sound defensively blocks the shot. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, so we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. All right, so back-to-back -back entertaining rounds. We'll see how it goes in this round. We'll see which corner sort of maximize those 60 seconds on the screen. This is what happened in two very skilled, very coming together. Nobody has really taken a lead in this fight. Let's see who does it going into the next round. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. And a nice jab there, champ. The jab was a lost art in mixed martial arts. Guys have found it, and they are fighting behind it real well. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Oh, big punch lands. Beautiful head kick. Back to the overhand. Goes to the body there. Nice head kick. Right hook attempt. That's a miss. Beautiful body kick. Oh, Superman punch lands. Really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. And both guys really throwing with authority. Nice kick. Oh, he counters with a beautiful jab to the head. We told you off the top, he's got a decided advantage in reach. And he put it to good use. There. Nice straight punch. Just over three minutes now to go. Back to the well with that right hand. It's no good. Lee's all sorts of bruised up on his body. That is going to hurt something fierce tomorrow. Under three minutes remain in round four. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Nice one-two there. Yeah, he mixed it all up. Oh, and he lands yet another flush knee. That's going to leave a mark. And again, when you're using this length as effectively as he is here tonight, we might get a finish here in the not-too-distant future. There's no tell on that leg kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, man, this is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head at MMA. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy gets his leg up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it coming. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. 
Two minutes remain in the round. Let's go. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Look at oh, right over the top. This fight's gonna be over PC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. No wasted motions on those kicks. There's no tell. And he switches to Southpaw. Real sneaky by the Nice. Whoa! Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got him very bad. Oh, he might be out. One minute. How good is that right hand? Oh, combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. There. He's so accurate when he decides to attack. It is a sight to behold. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Lee going for the leg kick. He does not connect. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, setting up the left hook, but out of range. Big kick. Oh, beautiful combination of kicks. Counters now left hook to the head lands. Nice body kick. Big head kick. And what a run! All right, so that's the end of the round. He got some things done offensively, but defense still an issue. And as such, the cut on his lip is only getting worse. All right, so a big round for him there, maybe even a 10-8. There was a big knockdown in there, courtesy of the kick. DC, talk us through. He found his spot. I mean, he knew that there was a weakness. He found the spot. He recognized an opportunity to go and chase down that head kick. He threw it, it landed, and he almost got the finish. Continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that punch. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh! You wonder if the offensive fighter's gonna start to get frustrated here. Most, if not all, of these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. Just out of range with that right hook. That was a thudding leg kick. Decent right hook attempt, but it's no good. Oh, huge head kick. They continue to exchange. Good punch land. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Oh, man, head kick land. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Powerful leg kick land. Punch over the top. He missed with that jab attempt there. Good job of hiding that head kick. 
All right, well, it's late in the fight. Time is of the essence, and when you're clearly losing and you know you need a finish, risk management goes out the window. Oh, yeah. No more risk management. Either get knocked out or you knock him out. One way or the other, you're going to lose. You can lose by decision or you can lose by knockout. But at least when you go for the knockout, you give yourself a chance to try to find your shot. What a punch. Huge block there. We got to whip his hip into that kick. And that one certainly found the target. Ooh, what a head kick. Two minutes now to go in the fight. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Big head kick land. The next there with the punch. Just misses there with the left. Well placed kick there by Lee. Now connects with a right. Whoa! He was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. Oh, that's a nice strike. I mean, oh! Oh! oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. What a last minute! the distance as we await the judges' scorecards, but certainly a dominant striking effort out of that fighter tonight. John, he used his best weapons in order to carry him to a decision, a very clear decision, in my opinion. A great performance tonight by this young fighter. The judges saw it. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest 48 47, 49 46, and 48 47. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, 